What's up everybody? In this video, I'm going to show you how to transfer Android data to iPhone. So for example, if you are switching over from Android to iPhone and you need to transfer all your data, there are multiple ways. One of the ways, if you're using AT&T or Verizon, they provide tools that can do that. But while you're setting up your iPhone, there's going to be an option and I'll show you how to do that. So if you have a brand new iPhone or if you just reset to factory default, we need to turn it on. And now we just need to go through the setup process on iPhone. Choose your language, choose your country. Right here, I'm going to click setup manually. Now connect to your Wi-Fi. Once you connect to your Wi-Fi, click next. Once your device is activated, click continue here. You can set up face ID later. I'll do that later. Passcode. I'm going to set up passcode later as well. And once you get to this screen, so there's a couple options. Restore from iCloud backup, restore from Mac or PC, transfer directly from iPhone, move data from Android. So if we are actually moving from Android, then we need to press on move data from Android. So now we need to open our Android phone. Now we need to go to Play Store. In a Play Store, we need to download an app called Move to iOS. Once app is installed, click on Open and then Continue here and Continue here. Then Agree and then click Allow. We have to make sure our location service is turned on. And now press continue one more time. And now we have to enter the code from your iPhone. And then click continue. Then click connect. And it says connected successfully. It's authenticating right now. And now there is an option where we would like to transfer Google account messages contact, calendar, and camera roll. I'm going to leave everything checked and I'm going to press on continue. You can uncheck, for example, if you don't want Google, just press on it and the check mark is going to go away. I'm going to leave it everything as default and then I'm going to click on continue and that's it. Now we just have to wait until it's going to transfer all the data from your Android to iOS. This process could take a few hours. It all depends how much data you have on your Android phone. Two hours later. Once the process is complete, you'll see on Android device it says transfer complete. Right here, we just have to press done. And that's it. Now we just have to wait on Apple device until it's gonna finish arranging everything. That's it. Transfer is complete. Now just press on continue setting up iPhone. And right here, you can enter your Apple ID. I'm gonna skip for now. I'm just going to click set up later, then continue here, continue, I'll set up later, not now, I'll set up later Siri and a screen time and then continue here, appearance, I'm going to leave it at light, continue, standard, that's it, iPhone is set up and ready to be used and all data is transferred from Android to your iPhone and if for example iPhone is already set up, just reset to factory default so that way you'll have out of the box experience and it will give you an option to transfer data from android device and this is it if this video was helpful to you press that like button and don't forget to subscribe thanks for watching